Hi everyone, it's Brendan. And Michael. Um, today is a very, very late podcast. Um, the main reason for this is because we had exams and things on at school and we couldn't really kind of play the game, let alone, let, let alone um, make podcasts of the game. And there wasn't really much going on, so we haven't really been that motivated. But um, after today's big news, not on our server, but on the Korean server, it's um, a new course. Yep. But about mines. Yeah. Um, so this new course has a new trailer, of course. And um, this came out in Korea today on the official website. And it's playing now. Um, so yeah, do you want to talk about the course, Bren? Yeah, so basically, um, what, what we think, um, it's going to be, it's very speaker related, because, well, we're thinking it, this might be the reason why she came, because just little things like the way the, um, the mine, um, machinery is coloured, it's the same colour as, um, speaker's default outfit, not, not the one you get when you purchase her, but, the one that you always see in the trailers and the cheapest one, like the first outfit I had for her in the store as well, it's painted that same colour. So the white and the um, pink. So we think the reasoning is she might have came to Panya to mind this stuff for her her plan or something like that. So that's what we really think. And she'll be able to set it up because it's not just her and Roy. After we found out with her motion item, there's a massive army of Roy's. <laughs> so we can actually... So she's actually pretty much set up to have the facilities in a way to make a giant mining area. Yeah. And um, there's also a new caddy. Yeah, this caddy came out, I think, two weeks ago in Korea. We couldn't cover it, but um, yeah, she looks kind of like a witch or like a witch combined with a nurse. Um, and hopefully she comes to our server and hopefully she comes to our server not as gacha. Um, luckily in Korea, oh, sure. she's not gotcha right but now. But she should come as gotcha. I know, that's the same thing. Ugh. It's like Alien Tori wasn't gotcha in their server. Yeah. But we'll see. Hopefully that'd be nice. Um, but... Alien Tori wasn't even gotcha in um, Japan. Yeah, but e- either way, um, she'll still be points, of course. But, um, yeah, exactly. I think I'll get her. She looks really cool. Yeah. So, yeah, well, with this new course, what I noticed is um, there's a bit in the trailer where the ball is rolling on the ground and you, uh, seems like you can, like, collect the abbots from the ground. Yeah, well, um, what we're thinking about that, it's going to be kind of maybe like the spinning cubes, but you have to get a certain number before you get a prize, and maybe it's a guaranteed prize, or maybe it might be another randomness, randomness. Like, hopefully it won't be like the spinning cubes, where it's just, you know, the chances of you winning something is so slim. So like, the, they down the rates on everything. Like, in um, you know how we get the drum roll when someone wins something. Like <laughs> in um, Japan, their rates are so good they had to disable the drum roll and disable that bandana coming down. Cause people were winning that much. It was just constant drum rolling the whole time you're playing. Yeah. Because the rates are just that much, that good. Kind of sucks for us, uh, brother. But yeah. But yeah. So hopefully it might be something like get the certain number and you can actually buy like a set or something like that. I think it's not a set because that'd be quite expensive. They'll charge a lot for that. But maybe something like you can buy bits and pieces of things and I don't know. Just something. Don't make it a random chance box. You just make when you get like nine or eight of them. Yeah. Maybe something worth getting. Um. What's interesting is that. Uh, quite some time ago, I think last year, I um, won a card. It's called like an Abbott card or something. It has the like, same type of crystal picture on it. Um, so maybe like you couldn't use that at all. So maybe they'll actually make you be able to use it finally. Yeah, it had no use to it. So wonder. I kind of, I got rid of mine when I, when they bought out the um, card blender. Yeah. I have like no cards in it. <laughs> but I have two really rare cards. That's the main thing. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I have, you know, Titan Boo and um, a Panda Increase thing. It's, it's, all, it's, all, it's all good stuff. Yeah. So, yeah, this. But it cost me like 30 cards. 
This new course looks pretty interesting. Um, on the website, it says I couldn't read it entirely, but it says something about um, I think at least more news will come out on the 17th um, of this month, July. So if that's the actual release date, or if that's you know new just news or screenshots or whatever of the game, the course that'll be pretty cool to see. So yeah, that's about it for today, so um, thank you for watching, bye!